Let's talk autofocus point selection. So when you're using autofocus, there's a couple different options. You have auto. If I press the button on the front of the camera, you'll see it basically dims everything else and we can see auto is highlighted. If I rotate the sub command dial on the front, it'll, it gives me a grid with a dot in the center, which is basically my focus point. Now, if I use the D-pad here on the left, you can see that I can move that focus point around. And this is a lot easier to see in the viewfinder because you can see a bright red dot being moved around the screen. And that dot is basically what the camera is going to focus on. Now, sometimes you want to change this dot and you can't. And there's a couple different reasons for that. Well, one is if you're in, if your autofocus mode is in auto, you'll see that we can't change the focus point selection. So that might be the first reason. The second reason is because these cameras come with what's called an autofocus point lock, autofocus point selector lock, which is this switch right here. You can see around the D-pad. And when that's on L, you can't move the autofocus point. And that's basically so you don't accidentally, you know, move it to the side of your screen and end up taking a bunch of pictures and focused on the wrong thing. 